Hey everyone, welcome back. We are doing this second wave officially for Hasbro exclusives. This video is going to be Iron Man 460 Ball and Thanos 460 Point. Let's get right into it. Let's flip over the box. So these are Marvel exclusives for Hasbro Beyblade X. Um, we have a stamina version of essentially Helm Knight with 480 and Ball. And then we have a balance version of Lance Knight with 460 and point. So pretty nice. Um, we have red and yellow and purple and gold. So we have a gold version of point. All right. So let's get this box open and let's get the parts out. So yeah, we're going to do the same thing again where I just kind of want to keep these boxes these boxes are actually kind of nice. Um, so why destroy them? All right. Now we're gonna use this side real quick. And then we're gonna hit this side. And There's one side, and then I need to hit right here. And there we go. Very nice. Now I can open this up completely without ruining the box, essentially. There we go. Well, maybe. There we go. Okay, I was worried that tab right there was gonna get ruined. All right. So we'll get Thanos, the layers out first. Here is our Thanos layer. Our Iron Man, well, blades, not layers, sorry. Our Iron Man blade, our Thanos blade, then on the little box below is going to be our parts. Ooh, that's actually very nice. Yeah, that 460. Ooh, I like that. That'll actually kind of go good with Optimus. I'm not going to lie there. All right. Our Marvel ripcord launchers. And then we have our gold point. Again, another Marvel Winder Launcher. And then our 480 and Ball. We're gonna put this back in the box. And then just get, get it kind of nice and closed up. Just working on getting this box closed back up real quick. There we go. And there we go. Yeah, saved the box. Very nice. Um, so yeah, these little winder launchers, nothing too special. They're just promotional for our Marvel. We're gonna just move those out of the way. Um, let's get into Thanos. Let's get into these parts real quick. I'm gonna zoom in. So we have Iron Man, 460, uh, 480 ball, and Thanos, 460 point. All right, very nice. Let's look at Thanos. We have Thanos in this translucent purple and gold. Yeah, I actually like that. I dig that a lot. All right, QR code. Go ahead and scan that. Our 460, I do like this, this is nice with the blue and gold very nice and then we have our bronze this is more of a bronze uh bronze ish version of point very nice all right we have iron man in yellow and red there's the qr code we have our 480 in black and red with the little glitters in there that's pretty nice 
and then another yellow version of ball. All right, let's get the scale and we'll weigh them real quick and then we'll move on with the rest of the video. We have the scale. Yeah, I did some cleaning this weekend to kind of help out with the functionality of the this little studio area. So now it's not so much chaos to try and get things. Thanos, will we, we will weigh first. 29.4 grams, that is light. That is really light. Um, then we have our 460, 6.2 grams. Then our point bit, 2.2 grams. Iron Man, 31.7, so the layer is uh, automatically heavier. And then with Iron Man, we still do have the little heavy sided notch right there. So uh, it's pretty interesting. 480. 6.8 grams and ball 2.1 gram oh, two grams so obviously iron man is going to be the heavier of the two so let's assemble thanos all right thanos in all of his evil wicked glory 37.8 grams. That is ridiculously light, you guys. Ooh. And then we have Iron Man. Fully assembled. Very nice. And 40.5 grams. Yeah, Iron Man definitely, definitely outclasses Thanos in weight. So... That'll definitely be interesting to see what happens here. Sorry, I'm just turning off the scale real quick, and then we'll get into some battles. All right, let's get the stadium. Yeah, I hope you guys are having a great weekend as well. Um, it is Saturday. So, yeah, very, very nice. We are finally in October for the year. Hopefully you guys will have a good October. Get For all of you who celebrate Halloween, we'll have a good Halloween this month. So, yeah. All right, so first up. Sorry, I was looking for our secondary launcher here. First up, we have Iron Man. Very nice. Next up, we have Thanos. Three, two, one. do some battles we'll do the iron man versus thanos three two one. Oh, we have a pit release on iron man will iron man survive or will it get burst dude if iron man gets this win with a pit release nope thanos does not get the burst but that was so close all right first point goes to thanos Spin finish. Three, two, one. Now that's a nice, that's a nice start. Both bays start at opposite ends of the stadium. Definitely a good start. And spin finish for Iron Man. So we are tied one to one. Three, two, one. Oh, and that is three to one. Iron Man gets that uh, stadium out finish. 
Three, two, one. Let's redo that one. Um, yeah, I just wasn't a fan of that, how that played out. Three, two, one. There we go. I feel like that went to Iron Man, but that was a little too close for to call. We'll consider that a draw. I do feel like that went to Iron Man though. Three, two, one. Ooh, Iron Man is tipped over. Can it recover? Can it recover? And Thanos with some excellent dodging scores another point. So we are now two to three. Three, two, one. Swing out Iron Man, but it didn't work. Very nice, very nice indeed. So Iron Man is the better of the two bays. All right, let's do a quick battle between Optimus and Iron Man. Optimus does have 460 points. Iron Man has 480 ball. Let's go ahead and do this and see who is the better Bay. Well, the better remake of Helm Knight. Three, two, one. And right away, Optimus getting that burst finish. Very nice on Optimus's part. Two points goes to Optimus. All right. Three. Wow. Three, two, one. Let's go. Ooh, both bays tip over. Both bays recover. Will Optimus score another point? Optimus. Three to zero. Three, two, one. first point very nice three two one and optimus, hits. optimus wins again all right so optimus does wind up being the better of the two bays there is one last battle i want to do usually i would do this in a separate video but we're just going to go ahead and do it now we're gonna go that we're gonna throw Thanos up against um Knight uh Lance Knight. Just uh just just because we can and we have a little bit of time left on the clock, just to give you guys that extra little bit of content. So Thanos versus Lance Knight. Who's better? The original or the remake? That was clean. Holy crap, that was clean. All right, Thanos with an extreme finish. Three, two, one. Lance just needs to keep Thanos off that extreme line. I was not expecting an extreme finish. Wait, do we have a pit release on Lance? Oh, Lance is dead. Um, No, we did not get a bit release on Lance. Lance is just... Lance just always sounds like it has a bit release. So yeah, Thanos wins this time around. We'll do a separate video for that, but I just figured, you know, hey, might as well. Um, is there anything else? I don't think there's really anything else I want to do as far as this video is concerned. Um, so with that being said, actually, you know what? Let's throw him up against Dronzer real quick. We barely use Dronzer anymore. So we got the emerald green version of Dronzer. We're gonna go up, uh, Iron Man first. Three, two, one. Yeah, just cause we got some time left on the clock. And Dronzer with a stamina a spin finish. Three, two, one. Are hopping up in the air like it always does. Down 
bouncing around. Hitting underneath Iron Man. Man, that 380. 380 is its Achilles heel. I don't know why they decided to do 380. Um, I feel like they should have released it later and given it like 560 or even 570. 3, 2, 1. There we go. Very nice. Bronzer now has three points. 3, 2, 1. Yeah, because I feel like if Karatomi would have released Bronzer later, giving it, you know, 560 or 570, it would have done wonders for Bronzer because it would have balanced out the blade a little bit better. Iron Man has now two points, two to three. Three, two, one. Oh, very nice. And Iron Man, again, three to three. Three, two, one. So much wasted stamina right there. Yeah, this is probably gonna be Iron Man. And Iron Man. All right, so very nice. Now it's Thanos versus Dronzer. Three, two, one. Very nice. Thanos beating out Dronzer in the first round with a spin finish. Three, two, one. Both bays cancel each other out, keeping them from getting them big play moves. Now it's down to stamina. <laughs> Which Thanos again. Another spin finish. Spin finish for Thanos. Three, two, one. Woo! Thanos with another extreme finish. All right, so that's going to go ahead and wrap up the video there for you guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. A um, little short video for this. We did, you know, a couple different batches. We did the match itself. Um, overall, Iron Man is the better bay, but you get some really good parts as far as Hasbro concern. So I do recommend picking these blades up. Um, you know, getting the 460 in point is pretty good. And then the ball plus another Night Helm um, equivalent is also really nice, especially it's decently weighted for a remake. Um, so other than that, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. As always, please continue to like, comment, and subscribe. With that, three, two, one, let it rip. Have a great weekend, everyone.